the men to take center stage here in Mexico City as we are set for the individual bronze medal match for the men. And coming up on target number one, from Russia, Arsalan Baldanov. You can see ranked 24th in the nation, or in the world, 9.25 event arrow average. Representing the Netherlands, coming up on target number two is Steve Weiler. Steve just came out of nowhere this year. He showed up at his first World Cup, took home gold for individual. It was 20, nuts. 21 years old, now ranked seventh in the world, 9.12 event arrow average. 9.17 his normal average in competition. So the 21 year old Steve Weiler will go up against 21 year old Russian, ranked 24th. This is for bronze medal. The crowd starting to respond here. We'll see who's going to start off. All right, so Arsalan Baldanov from Russia will get us going. First opportunity for each of these shooters to come up on stage. Take a look at this finals field. Good solid nine. Wilder, oh, little English on the release, but a nine as well. Baldanov getting closer to that ten ring. Ooh. Drifts it a little bit to the left. Yeah, he's Grabs. making some side adjustments yeah. there. Grabs a couple clicks. A little shaky. A little and a long ball. hold. Five seconds to remain. Oh, oh my gosh. Well, that paid off. <laughs> wow. <laughs> a smile from Maldonado. No Weiler with a nine. nine. On the other side. Yep. So a little side adjustment there. Maybe a little too much. Or maybe just not the shot he wanted to execute. So just like that. Baldanov goes up two to nothing. Baldanov 39 matches to his credit in his career. He's won 26 of them. He's been in four tiebreakers. Arslan Baldanov has been in four tiebreakers in his world archery career. He's won three of them, 75%. So he understands what pressure is about and obviously responds to it well. See, if you look at that release, this thing is long gone. His arrow, his fingers don't open at all. His fingers are just relaxed, the string flies right past, and they, his fingers continue to stay relaxed. Set number two. Weiler will start off as he is behind two to zero. Hear the wind picking up a bit. Yeah, you can see it blowing just off of his hand. Oh, oh nice shot. Doesn't bother him. Shot two to the left, one to the right. Now he's in the middle. Hashtag what wind <laughs> for Steve Weiler. Our microphones around the field, you can hear that wind blowing. Another long hold, yeah, holding off. Eight. Mm. It's like he was compensating. Uh, his, his release just looks like he's coming off his face a little bit. Oh, not bad. Not bad considering yeah. the way it looked. It's crazy how you can just feel where the arrows are going to go right as soon as you let go. That was a quick shot. Yeah, better timing. Yeah, better timing for Baldanoff. Steve Weiler with a slight lead in this set. Oh, nice, nice shot. shot. Yeah. Low 10. But a 10's a 10's a 10. So he'll take this one. 
As Baldinoff answers, and that's good. That's the confidence you need in the win. So we're all tied up at 2-2 in the men's recurve bronze medal match here, the Mexico City 2017 Hyundai World Archery Championships. All right, so we're all tied up. We're looking at Baldinoff's release. Yeah. He goes up and out. It's a little bit different. His, you can see that his hands are sort of twist off the string. Um, Almost like plucking. Isn't that isn't that part of what recur? It's not quite that, is it? But. Yeah, kind of. Plucking is sort of when you have a lot of tension in your fingers too, which will give you a lot of left and right, maybe up and down as well. Um, it's just different. He just he just sort of twists his hand off the string a little bit, mm. which may cause some, uh, I guess, variability in where his arrows are going to go. Made his international debut, this archer did in 2012. He's a student. Competed in World Championships, World Cup, multi-sport events as well. Last wins coming in multi-event in August of this year in Taipei. Balls it off to shoot first. Yeah. Oh, seven. Yeah. Tried redirecting that one, but it wasn't enough. Nice shot. Wow. Right Did in the middle. Exactly, exactly the same arrow hole as before. Quicker. Most of his arrows are down and to the left. Wind blowing just a little bit. He's trying to get that wind to calm down for him. Oh, nice. I know, and that's a good shot in that condition. Yep, considering the wind, considering how long his hold was, that was a good shot. Mm -hmm. So the best, hold it off the view. 25. His timing is considerably shorter this end. So all Steve needs nice. is a good solid shot. shot and he'll wow. take that set. A little smile. He definitely looks relaxed right now. He's just sort of smiling, telling his coach maybe what he felt. But he's going to have some confidence going into the next set for sure. Okay, target one, nine, nine, seven. Just shot two 29s. I mean, how can you not have confidence? Especially in this win. Yeah. I mean, it's very impressive, the swirling, unpredictable win. So for Boldenoff, 28, 27, 25, his tally. Steve Weiler, 26, 29, 29. And that's where we are at Boldenoff, two set points, Weiler four. So to stay alive, the Russian student needs a tie or a win to keep his chances at a bronze medal alive. For Steve Weiler, all he needs to do is just deliver the way he's been. That's right. Just needs two more set points to take the, the bronze. Boldenoff has not shot above 28 yet. And he shot 28 three ends ago. Arcelor and Boldenoff. You get the feeling this shot is going to be critical to keep his hopes alive. Ah, oh, if you look at the way he, that he's drawing right now, or the way that he draws, he sort of brings the bow up, sight is on the target, and then he draws back. Mm -hmm. Nice shot. Oh, oh. Ten for Steve. Watch this shot process. That push-pull method. Yep. Good release good. and a good solid nine. And the gold is what you want. That looked good. Oh, matched his first one. Another ten. Nine. So 26, so a seven to win for Steve Weiler from the Netherlands. Oh, oh right in the middle. Oh and a 30 gosh. and a smile from the 21-year-old. Nice shot. A perfect 30 in these conditions. And Steve Weiler will bring another medal home for the Netherlands. Bronze, an individual recurve. Fantastic. First year out here on the national team. 
um, Shooting World Cup events. I mean, I'm sure he's ecstatic right now. You have to be. A little shaky first end with a 26. Get those nerves shaken off. And then it was 29, 29, and 30. To run the table after set number one was over. And he did it in fine style. A beautiful look at Steve Weiler's technique. And Bolden off. 21-year-old student. We expect to see a lot of Arsalan Baldanov over the next